Almost two weeks after our big snowstorm and some Chicagoans are still dealing with this dumpsters packed with so much trash. The lids won't even close. CBS 2's Marissa Parra joins us now live from Wicker Park where one mother is running out of patience. Marissa. Well, her question is if an alley like this one is able to be cleared enough so that cars can pass through, as you can see that one behind me, then why aren't some garbage trucks able to do the same? As Chicago warms up, Chicago and patience is running out. And this is like our two bins of three to four weeks of trash. Gone are the thick blankets of snow and Wicker Park residents like Christina Cedeno hoped that would mean the trash would be gone too. Especially since the snow has melted. She's got her hands full with a toddler and every parent knows how fast a toddler can fill the trash up. Now it's filling up her hallway. We do have some disposable diapers that we haven't been able to take out. She knows snow and ice can cause a problem. A viewer video shows one unlucky waste management truck stuck in the snow, requiring a little extra help getting out of a Logan Square alley Tuesday morning. But it was when trash and other bins in the same alley started to disappear, she started having questions. And I said, huh, like all these other <laughs> trash bins are empty and ours is not. A neighbor called waste management asking for a courtesy pickup. They said they would come Thursday. And then they didn't. So it's been a bit frustrating. I just want to get this result. I just got off the phone with waste management not long ago. They said they can't account for what other garbage truck companies are doing and their safety protocols, but theirs is such that the two times that their drivers tried to come through here, they said it was too unsafe. It was too icy further down the road for them to be able to maneuver that. They're going to try again tomorrow. Reporting live out of Wicker Park, Marissa Parra, CBS 2 News.